Hey y'all, welcome back to Sin City Review. Today, we're checking out a Wild West Guns Co-Pilot, of course chambered in 457 mag. Uh, when it comes to the metal on the gun, it's a tricolor theme, and uh, the wood, of course, makes it four colors, so a lot going on with this gun, but all in all, it turned out pretty cool. You know, it's cool to be different. Starting off, got Desert Sage on the receiver, the frame, of course the bottom metal as well. He brought that back up in here to the end cap on the fore end right here. The barrel, the magazine tube, the lever, that's all Magpul Flat Dark Earth. And gun metal gray for the trigger, the hammer, basically your whole control group and all your screws. All in all, I think it turned out pretty well. It was kind of weird at first spraying these parts without, you know, seeing them on the gun, but with the end result, I think uh, it did tie in pretty good. It's definitely unique, I'll say that much. I like it. He didn't want all his internals sprayed, so I left the bolts completely polished. That way, uh, the action is a little bit smoother. Not that it wouldn't be with Cerco, but to start off with until it breaks in. If you start off with something polished, the metal just it just goes about it together a little bit easier. Go ahead and flip it around for you guys. It's a pretty cool contrast. I know it's not for everyone, but I don't know. I like it. It's kind of skeptical at first, but it's growing on me. So, if you're in the market for a lever gun, you want some Cerakote, there you go. If you're curious of what it looks, uh, the gun looks like with different colors on it, I have some more uh, Co-pilots I've sprayed, just check my channel, type in co-pilot or Marlin, and they should pop up. I think it turned out awesome. Pretty cool. Anyways, y'all, as always, questions, comments, concerns, leave them. And I'll answer accordingly. Until next time.